The city of Venice has run the first test of its multi-billion euro flood protection project by lifting four giant gates in the sea in front of its famous Lido Island. The system of hydraulic gates known as Mose, Italian for Moses, will consist of 78 mobile giant gates weighing between 215 to 320 tons, which will be installed across three Venetian inlets, Lido, Malamocco and Chioggia. Well, the idea is to stop the water entering from the sea at a certain level, so they are usually staying on the bottom of the channel and they are full of water. They are um, iron gates which are staying on the bottom of the, of the channel. And uh, we push water, uh, air inside and so they began to float. And this uh, uh, buoyancy force, uh, the force of floating, uh, helps us to keep the difference of level between the sea, which, is, which will go increasing by the tide, and uh, maintaining a safeguard limit for the city in order not to flood the city itself. Those behind the project say the system provides protection from tides up to three meters high and should be effective even if the sea level rises significantly during the next decades. No, Venice is flooded when uh, we reach 80 centimeters above sea level. And to protect the city at that height, it would have uh, been necessary to close 40 to 50 times a year. This is too much for the port uh, traffic and for the ecological problems we are facing in the lagoon. So the political decision has been taken to, de to defend the city at 1.10 meters above sea level, which is only five to seven times a year. Venice, one of the most frequently visited places in the world, is built just above sea level and has developed throughout centuries on more than 100 small islands divided by a network of some 200 canals. The cost of Mose, which is Italy's largest public works project and now roughly 80% complete, doubled to 4.3 billion euros a year after construction began in 2004. Last year, floods affected nearly three quarters of the World Heritage Site and tourists swam in St. Mark's Square, the center of the city that attracts millions of visitors each year. It was the fourth time since 2000 that Venice has been hit by record high tides, an increase in frequency that the Italian government has blamed on climate change.